Good deal. Come on, come on. As far as boxers go, there you go, Brad. Brad Moreau is not the most ferocious fighter to ever enter this gym. Come on, hit that bag. Truth be told, at 58 years of age, he just started boxing about a month ago. The arm's about ready to fall off at the shoulders. And with only a limited amount of training and ability. Hook it, hook it. Brad is already scheduled to fight one of the biggest and nastiest brawlers around. That is the first round. And many are asking if it's too soon to schedule a fight like this. Oh, no, definitely not. It's not too soon for him to start at all. Never too soon to take out a fight like this. And that bruising bully that Brad will face? is Brad himself. It's the heavyweight bout of the century. Nearly six years ago, Brad was diagnosed with Parkinson's disease. And I'm at this time in my life, I'm not willing to give up a chance to, to keep, keep the, the disease at least somewhat at bay. Two days a week at a gym in Chesterfield. Get those arms out there. Dozens of fighters just like Brad come here to learn a new way to battle Parkinson's. These people with Parkinson's are trying to get a sense of their life back. It takes so much from them you know, with their balance and coordination and agility and fine motor skills and they've got their trimmers. And what we want to do is we want to bring them in and we want to help improve those things. Definitely winded right now. It's about finding hope at the other end of a punch. There you go. Beautiful. Beautiful. They refuse to let this disease bully them. We're just not going to give up. You might have something, but what you want is every day to be as good as the day before. And so they fight back. You're truly fighting back against this disease. That is your opponent in the ring. Oh, don't give up or give in. You got this. Each drill works on a Good different deal. symptom. On. Good! Footwork for balance. Here we go. Stretching for stiffness. Awesome, Brad. And punching to steady tremors. Everything we're doing works on something that's trouble that you're having with uh, the Parkinson's. And when these Parkinson patients put on the gloves, they are boxers, no longer just a person with Parkinson's. Come on, come on. Focused warriors that leave their disease at the door when they enter this gym. If anything, it can take your, your uh, mindset away from the disease and doing something to fight it. Boxing is not going to cure Parkinson's. And when you can take your frustration out on that bag and you can hit it as hard as you can hit, you're hitting the disease. But it does seem that people improve. We all scream for dopamine. In Chesterfield. Nice job, guys. Wade Smith, Fox 2 News.